Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, factor 3 raised to power x out, and we have 3 raised to power x into bracket 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus bracket equals to 20 on this side. That is, here, yeah, this becomes 3 raised to power x times. 1 plus 1 plus 1, that's 3, then equals to 20 from here. The next step here, we divide both sides by 3, that is divide this side by 3, also divide this side by 3. Here we have 3 cancelled each other. And we have 3 raised to power x equals to 20 over 3 here. The next step here, we take the log on both sides. That is, here we have log 3 raised to the power x equals to log 20 over 3 here. Then here we apply the power of log ring. When we have log m raised to the power p, the same thing as p log m. That is, here yeah, how we have becomes x log 3 equals to log 20 over 3 here. The next step here, we divide both sides by log 3. That is, divide this side by log 3. Then also divide this side by log 3. That is, here yeah, log 3 cancelled each other. And we have x equals to log 20 over 3 divided by log 3. Then from here, we apply the law of logarithm. When we have log a over b, the same thing as log a minus log b. As this here we have x equals to log 20 minus log 3 over log 3. Then, next step here, we separate this into two fractions. And we have x equals to log 20 over log 3 minus log 3 over log 3. That is here we have log 3 comes to each other one left here which implies x equals to log 20 over log 3 minus 1. That is next step here we can write 20 as 4 times 5. Then what we have becomes x equals to log 4 times 5 over log 3 then minus 1. And this follows the law of log n when we have log a times b. This same thing as log a plus log b. That is here we have x equals to log 4 plus log 5 over log 3 minus 1. That is here we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 4 over log 3 plus log 5 over log 3 minus 1. Then also here, we can express 4 as 2 times 2, that's 2 squared. Then what we have here becomes x equals to log 2 squared over log 3 plus log 5 
over log 3 minus 1. Then, here we apply the power law of log length. That is 2 comes here. All we have becomes x equals to 2 log 2 over log 3 plus log 5 over log 3 minus 1. Then here we apply change of base from when we have log a over log b. This is same thing as log a to base b. That is here we have x equals to 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus 1. That is the value of x here we have. 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus 1. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus 1 then what we have here becomes 3 raised to power 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus 1 then plus also 3 raised to power 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 is 3 minus 1 also plus 3 raised to power 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus 1 is it equals to 20 on this side and here this follows when well, we have same thing together 3 times as this a plus a plus a this can be written as 3a. That is, also here we can write this as 3 times 3 base to power 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus 1. Is it equals to 20 on this side? That is, here yeah, this follows the law of indices. When we have a raised to power n plus n, this is something as a is to power n, and a is to power n, and also a is to power n minus n, same thing as a is to power n over a is to power n. Then here, this becomes 3 times 3 raised to power 2 log 2 base 3 times 3 raised to power log 5 base 3 divided by 3 raised to power 1 is equals to 20 on this side. Then here, this same thing as 3 times. We reverse this 2 from power log. We have 3 raised to power log 2 squared is 3 times 3 raised to power log 5 base 3. Then over 3 raised to power 1, that's 3. Is it equals to 20 on this side? Then here we have three cancelled each other. Oh, yeah, becomes three raised to power log two squared, that's four is three times three raised to power log five base three is it equals to 20 on this side. Then this follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. As this here we have four times. 5 here is it equals to 20 on this side and of course 4 times 5 it was 20 which is equals to 20 here that is left hand side is equals to the right hand side and therefore we conclude that x equals to 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus 1. Satisfy this given 
problem and thank you for watching don't forget the steps subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comment see you next class and bye for now